our supplier diversity team led by Chi Pack, our director, has put many new processes and procedures in place to advance our program. One, we're aiming to join the Billion Dollar Roundtable where we're spending a billion dollars plus with small and minority owned businesses. We recently implemented the Supplier Diversity Reward Program to recognize sourcing managers for signing contracts with diverse owned businesses. To further demonstrate T-Mobile's commitment to diversity, equity, and inclusion, we've partnered with Learning Alliance Corporation to create the Next Tech Diversity Program. The Next Tech Diversity Program was created to diversify the telecom technician roles. The program was spearheaded by my Chief Procurement Officer, Mike Simpson, and our slogan is, we won't stop. We would go over and above to ensure that we diversify not only our internal workforce, our supplier base, and our external telecom technician roles. So Caesar will provide you a quick overview of the Next Tech program that we're partnering on. Joyce, uh, thank you to really T-Mobile and really the entire procurement team. Uh, they've really been a leader in the industry to ensure that diversity and inclusion becomes an outcome in this industry. When only 9% of the industry is made up of a diverse population, to see that T-Mobile has stepped forward with the financial commitment and the support to ensure that these type of careers are just available to everyone. Uh, the future is very bright. We're very grateful for the relationship with T-Mobile. More importantly, each and everyone will notice that there's gonna be a major difference over the upcoming year because you're gonna to start to see a major impact of the industry becoming much more diverse, having a different lens. And as an outcome, we're gonna all become a better workforce. The next generation of workforce will be much brighter because of it. We wanna thank T-Mobile, we wanna thank uh, really the entire industry for backing, supporting, and understanding that diversity and inclusion, it's not just the statement, it's something that we all have to live and really support. Uh, if we really want to mitigate our workforce issues and our shortage, this is one of those opportunities to identify men and women that are underserved, that can be identified, educated about this industry, and the fact that we can put people into the middle class. The middle class, where it's no longer a job, it's truly a career, is something that Mike Simpson actually saw at T-Mobile as an opportunity. When you really look at where we are and where we're heading, the future is bright. And as Joyce said, we, we won't, won't stop. stop.